Hello everyone, this is Vita back with a second video for today. Let's get on into the energies, see what the guides, the guides would like for you to be aware of today. Take what resonates, kick rocks to the rest. Here we have the tribe, number eight, tribe and thinker. You could be a very deep thinker, higher power. You're getting all these beautiful downloads, new opportunities are coming into your life something is presenting itself someone or a group of people would like to present to you an idea growth getting the image of something growing growing something new original you're an original thinker someone's thinking a lot about you this is a number 44 we did see the higher power card so you're being guided directed move right move left Walk straight ahead, walking straight ahead, not wasting any more time. Going for it, you're going for it, someone's going for it, someone's making a leap, a jump. Here we've got orphans, someone's feeling abandoned, they're feeling abandoned by you being happy. Someone sees you soaring, soaring, thread, something about a common thread. Hmm. color someone could be having a birthday party you could be getting ready to have a birthday party these balloons are so pretty you could really love the uh, colors of spring easter this is reminding me of easter eggs easter egg hunt we've got this yellow this pink and this lavender oh there's a face looking back in this balloon so you're being watched over congratulations breath time to breathe time to take a risk something calculated look how those cards just fell out throwing something to the wind someone is throwing something to the wind milk and honey rewards time for a nap you've worked really hard it's time for a break poised Remaining poised, calm, calming nature. You could have a very calming nature. Time to get out in the sun. Someone sees you, sees your star qualities. Something at the end of the rainbow. Milk and honey. The ultimate destination. Ultimate destination. And we have to the sea. This is kind of giving me this orphan energy. So there's something that you have uh, left behind for sure. It's something that needed to be done. A change in the wind. You've changed direction. You might have uh, recently had a plan, a mission statement, something written out that you were hell-bent on following all the way through, but there's been a change in occurrence. Something's caused you to change direction, move differently perhaps even more quietly there's something that you're keeping quiet about someone's keeping quiet about you someone sees you as a gym a gym someone's been going to the gym working out milk and honey warm milk honey facial milk and honey facial beauty products you could be launching some sort of beauty product line Milk and honey. Ah, false person. Clarifying milk and honey. This is a number eight. This is a 51. But below this eight, we have this tribe, this eight. So there could be something that you're uh, being warned about. Being careful. It's time to be careful. 25, high honor. Someone is uh, being seen as false. You could be dealing with a false person, someone who once saw you as false is seeing the true you, something about the true you. Why is the time to nap here? 24, so that's 24, 51, that's 6, 6, 6, 6 energy, time for a nap. Oh wow, unexpected income and gift in the reverse landing kind of landed on to the sea someone has given up on something they just should give up on something 
giving up on the pursuit of something that's not going to come through. Bad health. Someone needs to rest, get their health together. Someone has abandoned some sort of dream because of bad health. They need to get their health together, get right. Someone needs to get right. Bad health, imprisonment. Someone feels uh, constrained because of their health. Time to nap. Someone could be having trouble sleeping, just wants a good night's rest. Time to nap. Unexpected income. Something's not coming through. A gift. Someone feels abandoned, orphaned. You, oh goodness. Main male, masculine energy, clarifying time for a nap. So there could be a main male, masculine energy that's taking a break. Community, this community could be this tribe right here. Someone wants to let go of false persona, false people, something about being fake. Can no longer stomach being fake. The tribe. Okay, we've got judication clarifying the tribe. Eight and 30. That's an 11. We've got this giraffe here, baby giraffe. Packed, someone's packed their bags, leaving, moving, not sure which way to go next. A lot of thinking is required. Bad health again. Someone's very um, occupied. Someone's very occupied with their health. Wise thinker here. High honor. And it's landing on happy, happy, and then bad health again at the bottom. So something about bad health. I hate to keep saying that over and over again. So let's see. That's what someone's focus is. Someone's focus is, is getting into better health, better shape. I do believe I said something about going to the gym. Thinker. Someone is trying to get mental clarity on a situation. Thinker. Thoughts. So think or clarify, 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 bide, biding their time, biding their tongue, thoughts, thinker. Someone's doing a lot of thinking about you. Could be this wealthy masculine energy, official person. So wealthy man, official person, high honor is already out. Thoughts, adjudication. Someone could be a judge. Someone could be a legal expert. Something about expertise being sought out, false advice, false advocate. There's something fake and there's something true. This could be some sort of transition someone is making, moving out of false light into the real light, wanting to be seen as the real deal, mature man, maturing, a mature soul, a mature spirit. Thoughts, thinking a lot about you, unable to stop thinking. You're all they think about. You're all they think about. Could be a thief in the mix here. Thief, theft, could have been a theft. Why is false person here with milk and honey? Someone wants to steal your joy. They don't want you to uh, move any further away. To the sea, unexpected income, gift in reverse. Someone, a thief perhaps, doesn't want you to receive a gift. A monetary gift doesn't have to be. Why is false person here? You have what it takes. Ace of Wands, you have what it takes. This is a three of wands that's in the reverse, landing on to the sea. And it's with this two of swords in the upright. So someone's not waiting anymore. Someone's operating on blind faith. Something to do with blind faith. Taking a leap. Wanting this new beginning in life. Knowing that they need to take a time out. But they feel that they're running out of time. Someone feels they're running out of time. They can't waste any more time. 
This might be their last chance, something about last chance, M making a blind move, operating blindly. False person, milk and honey. Okay, this is landing on high honor, ten of cups with uh, happy, happy. So I feel like this is your energy. Someone is thinking about how you have continued to live your life, how you conduct yourself in the world, how you present. You're, you present yourself in a way that whoever this is thinking a lot about you isn't accustomed to seeing. You're very genuine. Whoever you are, you're very genuine in your feelings. You find joy and absolutely what some would consider mundane things. You find joy in everything, the colors, the sky. You could like to stare at the, at the uh, clouds, the stars. You could love the color blue. You could love the water. Something about really blue water. Delight. You could be quite delightful. Someone finds you as a very delightful company. Someone wants to be in your company. All right, I'm going to try this again for false person. Someone's hiding that uh, they've got some false motives here because I'm not getting a clarifier just yet. So false motives when it comes to this milk and honey energy. False person could be this thief here. Okay, what the heck? So here we've got the six of pentacles. It's sideways. So someone is thinking a lot about just what they didn't give. Someone... I always thought that they could just receive, 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 take, take, not have to give anything in return. Maybe this was some sort of circumstance that you allowed to go on in your life because it doesn't, you know, affect your happiness. But something happened, something changed. God showed you who you are, honorable. And so you've, you've moved away. You've changed direction. Someone wants to now give to you, thinking about how to give you something Someone should have given you something and they didn't. They held on to it. Someone held on to a gift that you should have received. False person. This could be one or two people. We do have tribe here. This is landing on main male. We've got the seven of swords landing face down. So there is a main masculine energy that you could currently see as a false person. They're trying to hide because the seven of swords landed face down so something is being hidden either from a masculine energy or this masculine energy is hiding some deception there's deception here hidden something's hidden ten of pentacles ten of cups you're in your ten of cups double 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 ten of cups ten of pentacles nine of wands someone wants you to work harder someone wants you to work Hard. They don't like to see you relax. You could be very laid back, just a laid back sort of energy. Takes a lot to ruffle your feathers. You're focused on whatever it is that you're doing. Could have to do with your home. Heartfelt. You're very, your energy's heartfelt by others. False person. Okay, here we go. King of Swords. Clarifying this false person. So this main male here could be this king of swords energy, false person. Or this could be another energy, this thief. We do have a lot of swords here, though, with the seven of swords, the king of swords. Thief is sometimes like the sword energy, seven of swords energy. Nine of no, Ten of Wands is at the bottom, and then that's followed by the Six of Wands. So some sort of movement. Someone is determined to change course when it comes to you, a change in the wind. Something's happening for you. Someone's asking why. I feel like this why has to do with someone's health. King of Swords. This could be a legal matter. Something legal. Why is adjudication here? Obviously with the adjudication card and tribe. So this could be some sort of court case where there's a more than one counsel. Someone's got double counsel. 
I don't know. Adjudication. Why is adjudication here with tribe? Someone could work for a law firm. Here we've got the moon, and it flipped out right with this two of swords and this three of wands in reverse. I did say that someone was operating from some sort of blind-sided type of position. Someone's not seeing something. Something's being hidden. It could have to do with their mental acuity. Somebody could uh, have some sort of uh, disturbances going on mentally and they're not aware of what's happening. Someone's not aware of something when it comes to their mental acuity. Someone could be, a, someone's portraying someone as being mentally unstable, instability. Someone's trying to cause some mental instability, illusion. Here we've got the devil, right? Someone's on some trick stuff here, man. Emperor behind the devil. So, and then this ten of wands again, again. <laughs> Oh my gosh, the way that I speak on camera is starting to get on my nerves. Someone's nerves have been like wrecked. Someone's nervous. They're wrecked. Reckoning. There's some sort of reckoning, reckon, reckoning happening. Recognize. Someone is afraid you're not going to recognize them. They look very different. It has to do with their health. Judication. Okay. Judication, Ace of Wands, landing on Judication and Tribe, followed by Justice. We already have this King of Swords out, so this does have to do with Justice. A new beginning, a new start, you're going on an award maybe, some sort of uh, civil, this could be a civil case, some sort of award is being handed to you, you've won a case, you're winning a case. Someone's being released so they can start over, start anew. Someone's being released from a false person that tried to use the legal system to keep them seated, up seated, at bay. Something's being kept at bay. Justice still at the bottom. Let's get a card for high honor. Okay, we got the devil. And it landed on happy. Someone wants to stop your happiness if they can't have you. They don't want you to have anything. Knight of Pentacles. Someone's been very persistent in wanting to come toward you. They've wasted a lot of time. They've waited long enough. They see that you've done some sort of switcheroo, maybe when it comes to your energy Someone doesn't like that you're happy, that you're being recognized. Unexpected income in reverse. Something about the moon. Someone could be a water sign. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, King of Swords. That's air energy. The devil. Capricorn. Goat. Goat. Curry stew. Someone likes to make stew. Hermit is clarifying unexpected income that's in the reverse. And then we have the lovers here. So this is some sort of contract, justice, and the emperor again, and the ten of wands again. So there's definite strong masculine energy here. Not sure if this devil is just the energy or someone. I feel like it is someone with this eight of swords coming out constrained. Someone wants to constrict your movement. You're a deep thinker, thinker, thought, hermit, unexpected income. Someone's trying to figure out how to get some money in. Someone's low on funds. Wise gift here in reverse. Someone wants to stop your gifts, stop your manifestations, stop your, your energy flow. Something about the way you flow, the way you move. King of Wands is clarifying gift in reverse. And then we've got this Eight of Cups. So this could be someone or more than one person that you've walked away from. You continue to move away, sailing away. Someone could like to uh, spend a lot of time on a boat in the water. Someone could be getting their boat out, boat, boat out of lodging. Something about boat lodging. Happy, happy. Okay, that's crisscrossing over 
the uh, Hermit, and now we've got this King of Pentacles. So, King of Pentacles, King of Wands, King of Swords. That's three masculine energies on top of this main male here. Thoughts. So, this could be three or four masculine energies, or it could be the same masculine that's in and out of all of these different parts of who they are but i feel like it's multiple people eight of pentacles so this could be a work dynamic expertise you could have sought out some expertise for one of your projects or something like that you encountered uh, a team this could be a team because we've got tribe here so this is a team something about teamwork a team king of pentacles king of swords King of Wands, Gift in Reverse, Unexpected Income in Reverse, Hermit, Virgo Energy, the Moon, Hermit and the Moon. Something's hidden, something's being revealed slowly but surely. The Devil, Major arc, major Moves, Major Moves, someone, this is like a 5D chess game between some masculine energies. It has to do with work. You're in this some kind of way but I feel like you know you've removed yourself whoever you are you've removed yourself you could have casted an illusion over these energies to uh, keep them away from you someone could be pretending that they're happy huh, this is very interesting darling very interesting let's keep going here let's see what's up with this king of swords False person, King of Swords, confinement, and it landed sideways over this moon energy. So as I said, there's some sort, and then we got right magic. Someone's trying to confine you using moon magic, something about this eclipse that's coming up that has a lot of people doing all sorts of interesting things. A lot of people are very worried about this solar eclipse that's coming up while you're just enjoying your time. Something about your enjoyment, how you utilize your time. Confinement. You can't be contained or confined. This is sideways. And then we've got overload. Your energy has overloaded someone. Your happiness has overloaded someone has them on a tear. Someone's on a tear. Could be this devil energy here. <laughs> this is entertaining. You could be very entertained right now at this point in your life. You could just be at the point where like things don't really rile you up. You just are more entertained than anything. King of Swords. And not in a, any sort of malicious way. You just are seeing things differently family family and that's landing on top of adjudication so this has to do with the family dynamic someone's left behind a family or they're being forced out of a family someone in a family is very ill we saw bad health at the bottom of the deck it's not coming out so someone is concealing some sort of diagnosis relaxation just popped homeless is at the bottom so this has to do with family starting new leaving behind something someone sees you have a happy family you're very loved someone wants to be loved by their family king of swords king of swords okay self-love and it landed on confinement so someone i feel like it's this king of swords here is having trouble commitment not honoring their commitments so this king of swords hasn't been honoring their commitments to others or themselves they aren't really able to love themselves and so they keep this is some sort of repeat repetitive cycle that this king of swords keeps playing out i feel like this self-love here is kind of you so whoever this is they're observing you quite quite a bit they can't tell if you're 
self-love is real or if it's something that you're just pretending this person can't identify it because they don't have it within themselves here we've got imagination someone's imagining natural disaster someone's imagining what a life would be like with you without all this drama someone's addicted to drama they just don't know any other way care just landed on tribe in the reverse so whatever group dynamic this is someone doesn't care at all schedule scheduling conflicts some sort of business enterprise where everyone is infighting something about profits profit loss loss of profit family families could be having to downsize because whatever sort of business this is someone's hiding money maybe indulgence overindulgences stubbornness someone's not listening to the advice that they're getting someone sought advice and they're not listening king of swords again king of swords is being very stubborn they don't want to hear it they don't want to hear it king of swords fury it's in the reverse it's landing on thoughts compromise and vow all of my cards are in the upright so when they fall out in the reverse that's pretty significant this fury is in the reverse has to do with the seven of swords that did land face down main male time for a nap fury someone can't be angry anymore because it's affected their health in a really detrimental sort of way could have affected their sleep yeah natural disaster illness commitment idea new ideas why is devil here okay curse trap and blessings so that's this magic with this moon energy here curse trap blessings this blessings i feel like is your energy you're you you just i mean whoever you are you really are uh doing it you're you're doing it there's something that you've left behind that you really haven't thought much about anymore and that has created some sort of current magnetic current but there's someone that feels trapped by your energy cursed cursed confined commitment they made a commitment to someone else to something else that they didn't uphold someone didn't uphold a commitment to you when it comes to some sort of finance financial agreement someone owes you some money someone could owe you some money you don't care you don't care if you get this money or not you've let it go you know that you'll be rewarded or maybe you've already been rewarded whatever is lost will be found again this is a lesson that you've learned you're not going to repeat whatever sort of cycle this might be with someone else or a group of people you don't care you just don't care and someone knows that they're trying to mimic you mimic your routine something about how you care for yourself you, you might have a routine you might be a vlogger blind again someone's having some vision issues eternal love someone saw you as their one and only they did something that put them on a different course disturbance dealing with a lot of disturbances someone can't find peace they just need to take a nap someone can't take a nap they could live in a very uh, noisy environment could be a prison cell doesn't have to be but could be someone is uh trying to get out of a sentencing a sentencing they want to see their family maybe someone's trying to avoid a sentence because of an illness someone in a family could be ill got man hunter and god is in control i want to get some more clarity on all of these king energies here king of pentacles king of swords and this king of wands 
this main male here. Yeah. Okay, let's see. Let's see what we get. So, King of Swords. We'll start with the main male. Remember, there is a false person here, so I'll put that there as well. So, false person. False person. Do not lend them the money. They have no intentions to pay you back. Taurus, Virgo, Leo, it did land on trap. So someone wants to put you, a false person, in some sort of financial trap. Screw up your finances so you can't move forward. This person could be a Taurus, a Virgo, Leo, doesn't have to be. We do have the Hermit out already. Why is main male here? Infatuation, and it landed on this King of Wands. So there is... An energy of more than one masculine, very much infatuated with you. This main male could be this king of wands energy, or this could be two different ooh, conjoined twins. This is someone that feels very much attached to you, mass exodus. There's a lot of people that could be departing from this person's life, which is fueling their infatuation with you. They feel a connection. They feel a connection conjoined twins that can't be separated they can't they can't separate themselves from you maybe this person has tried to uh do some magic to break whatever connection this is they're unable to the moon and the devil whoa conjoined twins conjoined eternal love eternally conjoined holy moly Infatuation for sure. Whew. King of Swords. King of Swords. <laughs> Fake psychic. You des deserve real love. <sighs> Fake psychic. You deserve real soul love and will have it. Nothing comes without sacrifice except to those who sacrifice what they shouldn't. Arise, O Lord, deliver me, O my God, strike all my enemies on the jaw, break the teeth of the wicked. This is clarifying this King of Swords. This King of Swords got faked, got duped when it comes to you. This main male energy could be a new energy. This King of Swords could be an, a past energy. There's something fake about intuition someone faked knowing something someone knows that you deserve real love they want you to have it but they can't stop coming for you they're addicted infatuated there's a eternal bond here between you and you could have a couple of energies that feel that they're uh, eternally connected to you hmm. you could be in the public Someone sacrificed their relationship with you. Chemtrails, aircraft. Let me put all of these back. I just want one card. Please and thank you, Spirit. King of Swords. Okay. Mind control. And it kind of landed on curse, between curse and trap. So this is someone who doesn't have control over their mind, hence this infatuation. AI-generated photo. Hmm. This person could be some sort of technology expert. Something about mind control, mind games, mind control. This King of Swords used to be very sharp. I said used to be. It doesn't feel like they have control over themselves. They feel trapped, cursed, cursed. Brazil again. So someone could certainly be Brazilian, have a business in Brazil. Could be some sort of manufacturing, mind control, air energy, Gemini. Pisces, no, Pisces is water, Gemini, Aquarius, Libra, Brazil, mind control. 
Air is all about the mind, control, control in the skies. Hmm. Brazil. Someone could have recently traveled to Brazil or through Brazil. What's this? Conjoined twins. It came out. Trapped. Someone feels trapped. They can't let you go. This could be a twin flame dynamic. Designer handbag addiction. Someone's very addicted to the material realm. Nothing satisfies them. Addiction, infatuation, mind control. Someone's lost control of their abilities, their gifts. They're just too obsessed with the material world and you. They deeply love you, but they are afraid. And so they stay away and remain unhappy. This King of Swords has stayed away from you. They're very much uh, afraid of the feelings that they have for you. Okay, you could be a tarot reader. This person's getting tarot readings on you. Conjoined twins, that's already out. Clones, someone's tried to clone your energy. They could have went to a, a fake, fake relationship. False person didn't get what they wanted. The rumors are true, beware. So if you've heard any rumors about this person and you just can't believe that this is how they've ended up, those rumors could very well be true. King of Pentacles, you could have a King of Pentacles energy coming toward you. Canine unit, mind control. Someone could be a trainer, work in the canine unit. Know someone that trains dogs, German Shepherds, Brazil. Import, export, something about importing dogs, dog breeder, someone breeds dogs. Hmm. What's this? King of Wands. Someone could work in the police department, police force, mind control, canine unit. Hmm. Tarot reader. Someone thinks you're controlling their mind. Their names are Susan, Thomas, Alistair, Maven, Henry, Tory, or Troy. Could be, don't have to be. Clarifying this King of Wands in the reverse. We've got this uh, bio weapon. So definitely something to do with mind control. King of Wands. Kim Trails Aircraft. So this... These two kind of could go together. Someone could be in a, re a region, live in a region where the air pollution, the air quality is very poor and it's affecting how they think, could be affecting their vision. Something about pollution. Moon. China. So now we've got China and the moon. Something about China and the moon. And then we've got this lovely... 20, 30 cards. So this China and Brazil, this could have to do with currency, something about the moon, the devil. This could be, someone could be in politics or a political advisor. Why is the devil here? Someone could have recently come, traveled through China, traveled through Brazil. Someone could have to travel a lot for their work. Amazing Grace is clarifying this devil energy, which is quite interesting. Doesn't know how to swim. So this devil is some sort of shape-shifting energy. They appear graceful. They appear graceful. They are able to shape-shift, clone other energies, but they're scared of the water. They don't know how to swim. Someone's gotten in too deep when it comes to a devil Someone could uh, be born in China, born in Brazil. Someone could have adopted some children from either of these countries. Humiliation ritual. You are loved and protected. I want to know why this uh, China and Brazil are here. So there's a king of wands. There's the devil, amazing grace. Grace. God is looking over you. 
I don't like this deck. Five of Cups. Someone's got some regret when it comes to travel. Someone traveled into another country. Someone could have gotten in trouble in either of these areas. Someone could have gotten detained in China and or Brazil because we got the confinement card. So someone could be confined in a country that they're not originally from. Why is Brazil here? Okay, we got four of cups clarifying Brazil. And then we've got this queen of wands energy. So there's a queen of wands that could be connected to a king of wands. Someone's left, very dissatisfied, moved to another country, relocation. Why is China here? Four of cups, Brazil. Oh no, no, I need another card. China is clarified by page of pentagrams. And then we've got the five of cups. So someone could be traveling, just trying to get control of their mind, trying to break away from a situation that's caused a lot of uh, financial heartbreak. Someone doesn't care anymore. They're just traveling around the world trying to get away. But it doesn't matter where they go. They can't escape your energy. A lot of infatuation. Why is infatuation here? Okay, the world. So someone's been traveling the world. Someone's really enjoying traveling. That's how they escape. Five of Swords. Yeah, someone's left the country or leaving the country. Trying to escape some conflict it has to do with court. Someone could have homes, family homes even, in different places. Whew. Someone definitely is uh, traveling, trying to get away from something behind Five of Swords. We've got Temperance and then this Knight of Cups. Someone could be returning from travel. They want to apologize. They've had a chance to uh, really think, think things through. Six of Wands. And then we've got Ace of Pentagrams. So someone's maybe started some businesses too in another country. But this definitely has to do with travel, for sure. So this could be your energy. You could be traveling. You could be opening up some new businesses in other places. Or maybe even if you're like a shop owner or an artist or something like that, this could have to do with uh, scouting out product or materials or something like that. Something like that. So let's just close this out. Final messages for the collective. Something about currency, healthy lifestyle. So someone's making some changes in order to try to uh, recover their health. Archangel Raphael, eat a healthful diet, get adequate sleep. We already have take a nap, time to take a nap, exercise regularly for optimal health. So someone could be tra traveling to different countries because of their health. They're trying to get better, maybe conventional medicine, modern medicine hasn't worked. So someone's looking at like Eastern medicine or uh, just wanting to get into a different sort of climate atmosphere because we do have this chemtrail aircraft. So whatever that health this is, I feel like it has to do with uh, some sort of pollution, mind control, something, but then there's alternative medicine that someone has sought in other countries. Yeah, divine order is at the bottom and then passion. But someone's definitely still very passionate about you. Could be this main male masculine energy or someone that wants to be main front and center in your life. So that's what I have collective. Very interesting reading. Um, this conjoined twins is a card that I did write out this morning. It just popped in my head, but it really did feel like someone, an energy that is just kind of connected, that just, even if they wanted to disconnect, they couldn't, it's beyond their control. So I will see you guys soon in another video. Thank you so much for watching.